Welcome to another day of Alan's Reviews. It's not going to be a hostel or anything like this, but it's a brand new company I have here sitting on my table. And I have to give a big shout out to Jason for getting this to me and for a big thank you for allowing me to do a review on this. This is called, this company is called Heat from the Hammer and it is from Hamilton, Ontario, Canada. Once again, I've delved into the good old Canadian market because I can't fault them at all. So what do I have? Well, what I'm going to show you is the sauces first, put them to the side because that will be the very last I'm going to do. And then I'm going to show you these little snacks that I have and I'm going to do one of them uh, at the end of this video. So, what do I have? Well, I have the Devil's Punch uh, sauce. I then have the Rousey Red Number 5. And I have to say, the colour of those looks absolutely mm -hmm, right up my street. On the tray, on the, the mixes here, on the snacks, I have a Heat From Above. The Fairy Cheese Bites. I have that one there. I have a smaller one. It's called Heat From Above. Armageddon Unleashed. That one there. But the one I'm going to do today is the Battlefield Trail Mix. This is what I'm going to do at this moment in time. Uh, the Battle of Stony Creek, June the 6th, 1813. And on the back, uh, Lake Ontario has got. And on the back here, it actually tells you a little bit of a, a history on what happened that day. Uh, but I won't go into that at this moment in time. I'll try and get a photograph of it and I'll put it on the site for you. What it says here on their webpage is we've taken apples, pears, strawberries, baked them into perfection, then added plain pumpkin seeds, the best part of the roasted peanuts and sunflower seeds, coated in the rousy red number five. That seems to be the, the sauce that they use all the time, because I have noticed it's also on those cheese bites as well. To give it a bit of a kick, the result is an ideal combination of sweet and heat. When you need something delicious to snack on, and this is what you should be reaching for. What more can you say? So, let's see what this one has. Because I'll tell you what, the fruits that are in there is everything that I like. So, as I say, here we go. The Butterfield Trail Mix. Mm -hmm. Again, Jason, thank you very much for allowing me to do this. As you know, some companies don't like the reviewing their products. Don't know why. Oh. Oh, I love the smell from it. That, I would say, typical trail mix smell that you get with all the nuts and everything else. So, I don't actually have silly on me. And here, look at how it's. There you can see, I'll take that up there. You see bits of the strawberry. Okay. You can see all the fruit that's in here, the nuts, everything else. There you go. Oh, real mastery. So, heat from the hammer. Your battlefield trail mix. Are you going to satisfy my little truth? I'm going to say flavour today, not heat. Here we go. Let's go for the flavour first. If you love the trail mix type things, that there is way right up there. Got plenty of flavour about it. You can picking up the fruits and everything else. For it being with this sauce, now please remember, this is me. My tolerance is different for everybody else. 
but it's not even reaching a one on my scale at this moment in time. Uh, but remember, I keep on telling you, my tolerance is different from everybody else's. Um, I was looking at this one today for basic um, flavour. Look at all that. Oh, oh. Lovely. Lovely jubbly. Not wasting any. That is lovely. To me, that's a, anybody can take that. It's not even registering with me on heat at all. And that's not a criticism, that's me. When it comes to flavour for the, the trail mixes, that there is up there with the best. Believe it or not, I've actually got some here. I bought like a, a local shop that I love deep, and that's actually like that all mixed into it. And in fact, I'll show you one. Um, I want you to see what it was like. This here is made into like a wee cake type thing. There you go. That's the sort of things that I eat um, every week type thing, and that's that made into that. I have to say, absolutely love it. There's the bell of bits here. I'll take it, that's a bit up here. The strawberries are all there. You can see all that. The apples. Over there, you ask for, and a trail mix is there. That'll be funny to draw. So, My very first product from Heat from the Hammer. The Battlefield Trail Mix. If you love that type of stuff, it's right up your street. It's got the flavour here, picking up the fruits and the nuts, everything's there. When it came to the heat, for me, it's not even registered. I'm not even getting a wee tingle on the tongue. As I said to you, that's me. It's not a criticism. Okay, let's get let me going for something else now. Um, but there you go, very first one heat from the hammer. If the rest is like that, you're going to have no complaints from me. Well done. Roll on the next one. I'll see you all later. Bye.